Look at that fish, man. She's good. Oh, she's good. <laughs> Yeah. I think this is all I need. Tomorrow and back to the Carolina for me. See my girlfriend. Enjoy my life. Oh. They all want to be jigged off the bottom though, huh? It's so crazy. Nothing on the retrieve, nothing on the troll. Well, at least for us, all jigged off the bottom, man. Really don't have any words to describe what's going on out here right now, but it's just, you know. One's a pink, one in the pink. Oh, they're nice fish, man. Keep it picking away, man. I'm getting into the 30 inches now. Have your fish shrunk a little? It's starting to get 30 inches now. Oh, you got a dink, you got a schoolie, actually. It's the biggest fish I'm gonna see all year, for sure, that one. Yeah. It's a smaller fish here, though. I feel like I wanna run back up to the other side of this school. I mean, they're not small. It's still 32 inches, but I... After seeing those fish, I'm like, what's that? I want to like, I feel like there's bigger ones at the other end of it. I don't know, this is another like, I know, that's dumb of me to say. No, it's not. It's greedy. We can be greedy. Nah, I'm good. I'm a, tour I'm a tourist to striper fishing now. I'm no longer a... Savor the day. Savor the day. I'm getting on, I got a couple on pink just now, too. Here's what a good guy lies to be fishing is. Matt's gonna get a fresh pack, certified right. cow catching paddle tail. All right, look. 2019. Bass Assassin's coming off. All right. There it is. Thanks, brother. Appreciate certified. It. God, he's got, he got, oh my God, look at this zombie bass. Oh my God. Zombie bass, look at this zombie. Oh man, look at him. 
Dude, he's got his guts hanging out. How does he survive? Oh my. Serious zombie fish, man. Wow. I've never seen a striper look looks like this. Look at that. Look at this. This guy's like, he's got... I don't know, man. Amazing. I don't even know. tell you guys about today besides it being probably the greatest day of striper fishing I've ever had. As long as the color is bright, you're tapping bottom, you're hooking up. It'll work finding them. Definitely work to find them, but we got a couple again. Nice long drift. They're roaming, feeding on the flats, eating the bunkies, eating a lot. They're eating a lot of different fish. Ooh, another good one. Too many though. Oh, on the retrieve. <laughs> yeah. Like two set now, but like one crank off the bottom. This fish is mean, man. It's like clamping down. Real aggressive. What, what an aggressive fish. Cool. Right here though, we got plenty too. There they are. Oh, yeah. I got a nice fish here, man. Giant male. Male, big male. Oh, 
giant fish. It's just a slot. Nice fish. Fish really don't fight much, majority of them. I'm not gonna lie. The vast majority of these fish. They're just they really thrash. You know? They really thrash more than anything. they don't really run. They thump. They're thumpers. the bigger fish you know they take a one good bulldog run but I mean I'm, I'm fishing pretty heavy on my drag too I'm not really day ever it was good to start now yeah, I just got like stupid Big fish window might be over though. Yeah, I got I have this I feel like you're one hundred percent correct. Yeah. I'm not seeing marks like earlier in general. Uh so yeah, that was uh my one day of striper fishing that was really above and beyond. Um, you know, I haven't had a day like that in a really long time, and that was probably my best day of just jigging them like that in that style. We didn't troll a single fish, a couple casting. Um, so I fished with my paddle tails. Um, I make uh, five and a half inch uh, paddle tails, uh, six different colors they're available in. Um, I guess what you could say might be unique or a special trait about mine. 
Um, it's an extra soft non-toxic PVC I use for my pours. Um, that gives it a lot of swing action, um, especially when you're doing subtle jigging like that. As Papa shat up, um, that tail is really going to get going on the way down. And sure, you could say that I was just on the mother load of fish, etc. Um, but I think uh, my confidence goes in what I'm fishing with, obviously, at the end of the day. Um, other anglers might relate to that, others might not. So um, they come in packs of four. Uh, they're available in some tackle shops, whoever's messaged me uh, throughout New Jersey and New York and in North Carolina. Uh, Amazon.com, other online retailers are JNH.com, uh, one of the bigger supporters of the channel. Uh, I've been fishing with that. Penn Spin Fisher 2500 for those stripers. Um, and that's a Jigging World Nexus rod, another local New Jersey brand. Uh, that's their seven foot medium heavy rod. Uh, really great for that sort of fishing, you know, sweeping off the bottom. I really liked it for that particular method. Really not too much to give when you're, when you're sweeping like that. Um, and that's it, man. Uh, that was excellent. Just really excellent fishing. Uh, I'm glad you enjoyed. Uh, maybe you learned something from that. Um, you really haven't seen me do that technique too much for stripers. And it's something I've done over the years for sure. But um, uh, faced in that sort of condition, um, it really just was the ticket. It really was that particular day. And most of this season since uh, I found fish kind of deep in 20-foot holes, you know. I really haven't found them shallow. Like, I mean, I'm sure they're there, but that's not what I did this year. So uh, I've got one more striper video. Um, hopefully that uh, gets the striper request off my <laughs> off my back for the, the channel, as a lot of people are always saying, miss striper videos, miss striper videos. You probably got some of the best striper content out of me this year. So I hope you enjoyed.